Hello everyone, welcome back to another weekly recap with Fujisan Jr. If you like this episode, make sure you like and subscribe and I'll keep doing this. I think it's just a great outlet for me to just talk over what happened throughout the week. And I'm going to keep doing this whenever I have time. Especially during the summer, I guess on the weekends I don't have much, on Sundays especially, so it's great for me to just do this series. So yeah, I'm going to continue doing it. So yeah, overall this week, I haven't done much, per usual. It was more of me tutoring new students. I had two new students that I taught Japanese online, and that's been going really well actually. I've been making good money. I've been tutoring easy stuff, honestly. It's been just beginners Japanese, just going over different characters, greetings, and phrases that are important in Japan. And yeah, all my students so far that I've been working have been awesome, like they've been really engaged. They're motivated for sure. Uh, they really want to learn Japanese, especially this one student that I have. I've had him only once, but I can tell that he really wants to learn Japanese. So I gotta make sure that I answer that in order for him to get the best learning and for me to further figure out what I will be teaching. Because once I figure out like a specific curriculum, then uh, it's easier for me to like really teach students like what I'm supposed to be doing. And they're pretty much doing all the same things. So I can just repeatedly use the same lessons that I teach for like other students and just go on. Yeah, I also got a new student that I'll meet on Friday this week. So we'll see how that goes. But overall, Monday, just tutoring. I didn't do much on Monday, I just stayed at home. Tuesday, I went to go play soccer, which was nice, pick up soccer. I've been enjoying soccer a lot. It's been a great way for me to just go out, meet new people, because it's pickup, you just play with random people. Honestly though, it's been like the same people that I meet, but it's been competitive. A lot of arguing that I don't like because that kind of stops the momentum of the game. And it's just a waste of time. But overall, besides that, like it's really intense, like 10 minute game, winner stays on pretty much. Tie, the longer, longest team on the field moves pretty much like that, simple, and I was on a great team actually. I had really like young players and they were like really like good. They had a lot of cardio, they were moving, they were passing the ball and I was blessed to be on that team. It was just like, it made me feel like I was back in like high school or college where I used to play soccer seriously. So it was good, that was fun. Um, besides that, I've been just, you know, just grocery shopping, doing some errands. I also have to, I also got a new Alexa, so that's been really nice. Um, I can just use that to turn off the lights and set alarms and all that. Um, <clears throat> on Wednesday, I went to go work out with one of my cohorts from NIAC, which is the Yukon educational program. She's been one of my closest friends that I've made in that program, so it was nice just you know, catching up, just talking and just, you know, just working out and everything. And Honestly, nothing much happened the first couple days. Like literally, like just been tutoring, working out, or playing soccer, and then just like calling. Oh yeah, I call my friend on Monday, and we're playing Stumble Guys. Uh, if you guys want to check that out, I've been doing a live stream on that. So it's yeah, make sure you check it out because I've been trying to grind in that. I know there's no professional tournaments and stuff, but I just want to get good at it. So yeah, I've been I've been doing that. And what else have I done in the first one? I think that's pretty much it. And then Thursday, nothing happened. My girlfriend from another state uh, visited me. That was really nice of her because, you know, we're doing long distance. So it's good that uh, we met in person. She came all the way to Connecticut, which, you know, Connecticut doesn't have much, but that was a good experience for her to come visit. Um, Friday, she came into my school to help me decorate my classroom. I know it's early, it's, it's July. It should be my summer, but she loves decorating the classroom. So might as well have a helping hand. And we started organizing the classroom, start uh, tracing and drawing all the bulletin board ideas. I also looked into the students I'm gonna be having, which I'm very excited to have. I will have 18 students, nine boys, nine girls, which is perfect. So that is gonna be fun. I am excited to teach again. Honestly, it's been, I like this time that I had during the summer where I can just chill and do my own thing, 
do tutoring on the side, just make some extra income because why not? And yeah, besides that, I'm just been chilling. Also got my LLC for my self, which I will have to get my EIN later and all that. Which hopefully my friend replies because he <laughs> left me on red and he hasn't been got back to me. Which I assume he's just busy, so like you know, I'm just gonna give him time. Hopefully he'll reply one day. If not, then I'll probably reach out again. I don't want to be persistent and annoying, but you know, I want to get this business going. Uh, so I want this side hustle to go. But you know, like we all we have different schedules, we have different lifestyles, so I'm not gonna pressure him for that. Besides, I was the one that invited him to join this, so you know, it's it's up to him that if he wants to continue or not. And yeah, so I'm going back to the school. Um, we just decorated everything. It was, it was really nice. We got most of it done. I still have like, notebooks, folders and stuff that I have to label, which I'll have to do later because I haven't gotten those yet. I have to organize my tables, chairs, desks. I had to re-put the posters on the board because they had to paint and wipe the windows and stuff. So I'll have to do that later. But besides that, yeah, school, school stuff. We're probably gonna do that again. She's gonna come visit me in like two weeks again to just stick the bulletin board stuff and do other small things which I will need help with. So I'm excited for that. And then Friday night, um, Friday we just made. Oh yeah, I love uh, spaghetti. Spaghetti is one of my favorite dishes, and uh, we made carbonara, which is one of my favorite spaghetti as well. I like bolognese more, but. Carbonara is one of my favorite ones too, and that went out and that turned out real well. I started watching Love Island as well, the USA season six, which actually is very interesting. Like a lot of corny and cheesy moments, not gonna lie. And it's I know it's scripted. There are a few characters or cats that I dislike a lot. It frustrates me in watching them still on the show, but you know what can we do about that? So still been watching that. It's good. I'm gonna have to continue binge watching that whenever I have the time to. Honestly, I have to get back with making content because I will spend time with my girlfriend, so I didn't have much time doing that. Saturday, we just chilled. I think, yeah, Saturday we just chilled because we were just both tired. Just didn't do much. We stayed inside. We went to this, uh, the Parkville market that I've introduced in my, all my shorts. So go check that out. It's like a food, a lot of food, diff different country food vendors. And it's a really nice place I got or we got Jamaican food and halal food, which was amazing. I love Jamaican food. It's like one of my favorite dishes or cuisine more like, because you know, who who doesn't like Jamaican food? Like it's just delicious. So I enjoy that or we enjoy that. I keep saying I, we, we enjoy that. Um, continue to watch uh, Love Island. Then today, Sunday, we went to all you can eat barbecue place, which I felt sick after that because I try to eat as much as I can, make worth of the money that I paid for, but I kind of got too stubborn and I ordered way too much. And I, yeah, I finished it. We ate a lot actually, the two of us ate a lot, but yeah, I ate extra, not the best choice. My stomach was not feeling well after that. And then said goodbye to her because she had to leave. And then I played basketball after um she left it's been really hot unfortunately so yeah usually we go out like during the evening ish like around six ish but yeah the summer's been hot and i just i hate the summer honestly i love to break but i hate sweating that's the one thing that i hate about summer it's just not my favorite season honestly i know a lot of people love summer so you know it is what it is, but yeah, play basketball, won the 1v1 battle, which I'm going to be working on later for the upload. So hopefully you guys can check that out later. We are currently 2-1 in the series because of today. As, or as for today, we are 2-1 now. So we're going to continue this. You know, it's just a great way for me to play basketball. I enjoy it a lot. And yeah, I am going to continue to just grind prepare myself for next year and just make content. Hopefully I, I, I will learn and become a better educator next year. And yeah, if you guys like it, 
Once again, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.